So Marcus, shut up and get on with it. Play tonight's 80s icon, which is brought to you by Reliance Travel. Thank you, Agent Steve. That kind of fantasy game is becoming more and more popular. There you go. It's not very long, as always. Stop it at the back. That kind of fantasy game is becoming more and more popular. Yeah, who could it be? Who could it be? If you want to go, you are more than welcome to. You can phone me, 577-522 on your Tribunes, studio at gravityfm.net from your Commodore 64s, or from your Motorola Dynatax, you can text the word gravity followed by your answer to 60300. And let's see how you get on, shall we? I'll tell you what, it's a bit difficult though, isn't it? So we're going to crack on with a request now. This one goes out to Rob the Dormouse, my little sleepy friend from Colstworth. He wants something from Genesis, and this is Man on the Corner. must have passed me by during the 1980s Rob because I don't remember it I'll have to double check see if it was an album track he normally tries to catch me out he does Genesis a man on the corner here on everything 80s so the 80s icon proving well very very difficult because nobody has the correct answer and I repeat nobody so now is your chance to be the only one that kind of fantasy game is becoming more and more popular Yes, now then, we did have, I had to put the phone down quickly on Barabi Steve, because he was making a call on behalf of Barabi Sarah. Good evening, Barabi Sarah, I hope you're okay tonight. And I can say that you have the correct answer on the 80s icon, and you've joined Rob the Dormouse, but Rob, you were first. Okay, that's not a problem. You were first, and Barabi Sarah is right also. That's two of you were correct. You're not going to need the easy peasy clue. It was propaganda and Jewel, and they were German. Yes, they were German, and apparently the lead singer, or the girl out of the group, she's married to Paul Morley, the journalist. How about that? I was put on my misery by Rob. Thank you for that, Rob. <laughs> Well, apparently there is somebody under the age of 72 <laughs> listening in Stainbeat. Well, I don't know if they're li listening, but they definitely live in Stainbeat, and that is Rob the Dormouse's mobile hairdresser. She's a Stainbeat girl, and I'm sure Chris Weir was singing about her, but she's definitely under 72. subject of tonight's top on the flops was Midua. Midua it was indeed. Well done to Rob from Colesworth. Or uh, Rob or Rob the Dormouse, whatever you want to call him, he got the correct answer. 